ISC CM554 and ISL CM554 engines utilize common supplied air compressors from Holset and Wabco. The 42 tooth air compressor drive gear provides a 1 to 1 gear ratio to turn the air compressor at the same speed as the engine. Engine noise is reduced by timing the air compressor out of phase with engine firing to place a load on the air compressor at the appropriate time to maintain air compressor drive gear tooth to camshaft drive gear tooth contact. Pressurized air entering the actuator control valve is routed to the turbo actuator when the actuator control valve is energized by the ECM. Air pressure pushing on the pneumatic actuator moves the yoke and drives the nozzle ring towards the closed position. When instructed by the ECM, the actuator control valve vents compressed air allowing the turbocharger actuator return spring to move the nozzle ring to the open position. With the nozzle ring fully closed, the turbine volute exit area is at its minimum. This creates the maximum exhaust manifold pressure. Turbocharger shaft speed and boost pressure are at their highest. With the nozzle ring in the fully open position, the turbine volute exit area is at its maximum. This creates the minimum exhaust manifold pressure. Turbocharger shaft speed and boost are at their lowest. Coolant is plumbed to the center section of the turbocharger to cool the seals on the sliding nozzle ring linkage. Some industrial engines utilize a high-efficiency water-to-air aftercooler to reduce the intake air temperature. This system allows these engines to meet industrial emission standards.